Hey guys, uh, I just want to do a quick video on aggression and specifically uh, fin or nipped fins. So about a month ago I noticed a lot of my fish have nipped fins, uh, especially this black belt. He's one of my favorites so I, you know, I couldn't stand for that. Um, now as you can see, I'll, I'll zoom in a little closer to him, his fins are almost 100% uh, healed. Other fish, like even this in Spillum had um, some nip fins and especially these, also these uh, Severums, right? Um, and I noticed my arrangement in my tank, this is a 248 foot long tank by the way, so it's rather long, but I had the driftwood in the center of the tank, right, to create a centerpiece type of look. It looked nice, I mean I like it way better than it's set up right now, but the problem with that is it, it created only one territory in, in the center of the tank. Um, so there's not a lot of room to escape from the activity in the center. So therefore, every, all, the, all the fish were gathered in the center, close proximity of each other. You know, even though this is a relatively large tank, right? They, they have no choice but to kind of get in each other's way. Um, and the result of that is normally, you know, um, fin nipping. So I noticed that and I, I decided to split up the tank into two ends, moving this piece of driftwood or a couple pieces of driftwood to the left. Uh, just a side note, don't mind the divided tank right now. He's just recovering from a, from a recent, uh, recent attack when I was on vacation. And yeah, so back to this, uh, one uh, couple of driftwood on the left side of the tank and a couple of driftwood to the right side. So as you can see here, I'm gonna zoom back out a little bit. It gives two distinct territories, although you know no one really claims a territory right now. They're, they're, they're all pretty much behaving well as far as community tank goes. Um, but it gives the fish a large space in the center to swim and two distinct, I would call it areas, to kind of hang out in. Uh, and this, this results in less fin nipping and less damaged fins, obviously. So it's worked working for me. I'm not sure how it would work on tanks smaller than uh, or shorter than six feet, uh, but you know, you guys could always give it a shot and see. And I'm gonna go ahead and just zoom in on some of the fins and show you you know, all the fins are great. Here's this in Spillum. Uh, her fins are always really good. Uh, so that's probably not the best example. But the black belt, here's black belt number two, I believe. His fins are perfect right now. Um, black belt number one. So black belt number one had a lot of fin damage. But it's almost 100% there, recovery. This is after, you know, maybe three weeks of, uh, three weeks with this new arrangement. So he's looking awesome, as always, or better now than before. Uh, even the Zonatus, let me see if I can get a close-up of him. His fins are, are in perfect shape right now. Let's see if I can get him to the side. Um, yep, so he's he's looking good. Even the small the smaller subrooms, I'm gonna try to get in on this guy right here if he comes available, right? He's looking, or oh, there, there's two of them. They're looking pretty good as far as their fins are concerned. And even this gold server over here, who's kind of got stuck on this side with the other server who's recovering. Let me try to get him focused. So yeah, he's his fins is looking pretty good as well. So no major damage. Even the Midas, he had some some fin fin damage. Now he's looking good. Um, the blood parrots, no one seems to be bugging the blood parrots for some reason, <laughs> uh, which is, I guess is good. Uh, and yeah, so bottom line is, if you're having, you know, some aggression or mainly specifically fin nipping issues, try to spread, try to spread the, uh, the territories or the large uh, pieces of either driftwood or rocks or whatever decor you have in your tank spread spread that out a bit and to me it doesn't look as good as a centerpiece arrangement but I'd, I'd rather have my fish looking good 
than the tank. So, so there you have it. Try it on yours if you, you're having issues with that, and let me know if you know that works out for you or not, or if there's you know other ways you can think of to reduce um, fin nipping. All right, guys. Hope that helped somebody. I know it helped me tremendously. That's why I'm spreading the word. So if it helped you, let me know. And uh, till next time, guys. See ya.